card interest rates are at record highs. We are seeing triple trouble, basically. Ted Rossman is a financial analyst with Bankrate. We're seeing more debt higher interest rates, and more people carrying that debt. With the Federal Reserve raising interest rates to cool yeah, inflation, on average, Americans are paying more than 20% in credit card interest each month. That is just outrageous. Republican Missouri Senator Josh Hawley says struggling Americans need a break. People can't afford to pay that. He's introducing legislation to cap credit card interest rates at 18%. That is more than enough profit for these companies to make and it would really give working people a shot. But Rossman says a cap will do little to help alleviate financial stress. Honestly, if it's 16% or 18 or 20 or 22, it almost doesn't matter just because they're all high. Financial experts say consumers in a bind should consider using zero interest introductory rate cards to pay down their debt. Zero percent balance transfer cards last as long as 21 months. You have almost two years with no interest. I mean, that's a tremendous tailwind. Ross says he does not anticipate average rates to drop anytime soon. We remain strongly committed to bringing inflation back down to our 2% goal. While the Federal Reserve chose not to raise rates in September, as inflation lingers, the central bank is signaling another rate hike before the end of the year. In Washington, Raquel Martin.